Hello, and welcome back to Move Love Alternative. Last time it was... Huh? It was exactly what I thought it would be, really. And it was just really well executed. God damn. Oh, and I was told that the Makoto thing that I was worried about isn't something really to be worried about, so I'm not gonna really worry about it. It's basically what I thought it was before people start mentioning uh, quote-unquote route stuff and whatnot, so yeah. Today, the Empire announced the destruction of the Sadagashima Hive. Now the entire country is, uh, celebrating. Apparently, there's going to be a huge ceremony to honor all the soldiers who were killed in the operation. Right, because they all made such a difference. You know how- you remember how every single one of the plans, except one, was just like a complete failure. <laughs> yeah. Meanwhile, in stark contrast, we're only allowed to hold a private ceremony. We got nothing but these trees for graves. No bodies to bury beneath them. And that's the most we're permitted to do to mourn our dead, given our positions as member, uh, members of the Alternative Force Special Task Force. <sighs> Tomorrow's ceremony is probably meant to give the general populace the impression that Operation 21st was a huge success. You know, since <laughs> we totally was really successful in all our plans, right? I say it's in memory of the fallen soldiers. But they wouldn't be given a proper burial either. So the has been completely wiped off the map. And with it, the corpses of Captain Asumi, Kashiwagi, and all the other soldiers who were killed in action. Captain?わたしなきゃとも人類の勝利と大谷に行く方を関心に受けこれまで以上に精霊してくれることと確信する早瀬部隊に指揮を貴様に任せるよろしく頼む早瀬部隊に指揮を貴様に任せるよろしく頼む早
Like, what, a vacation? Or, I, I don't know. Huh. Eh. Bullshit. <laughs> Oh, yeah, what were we talking about? <laughs> Sorry, I got distracted. もう少し過去の力を抜くことを覚えろ。どうすれば本来持っている能力が身をむすばすさ。それは英子としてだけではなく、貴様の人生のいかなることにおいても必ずプラスになる。はい。貴様を見ていると昔の自分を思い出す。Oh, don't worry. She doesn't have a childhood friend. どんな時もそれを失わないでほしい。ありがとうございます。ただ普段の貴様はマイペース過ぎる。時には人の話をじっくり聞くことも重要だぞ。はい。同じポジションの風間からいろいろなことを学べ。いいな。はい。ありがと
彼女とは心に距離を置き冷めた態度で接していた今思い返すとあの頃の私は姉のようになろうと必死にもがいていたことがわかる<笑>私は私でいいんだということに気づいてやっと心から姉に向き合えるようになったんだ<笑>つまらない話を聞かせてしまったな達者でやれタイお世話になりました Oh, hey, uh, uh, oh, right, we have more to talk about? Ma'am. <laughs> oh, I hope people have questions about this. Captain. Alright. I. I will. Make it all up to her. <laughs> Ma'am. Rest easy, Captain. I'm not gonna break down and cry anymore. I mean, stop relying on others to help me back on my feet. Don't you worry, Gashiwagi. We're gonna wipe away every last bait from the face of the earth. Then your brothers won't ever have to set foot on the battlefield. <laughs> Just water now, eh? <laughs> it is completely gone. Uh, I guess that's the power of 20 G bombs for you. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get a lot of people to get a lot of a phase 4 hive is a max de uh, depth of 1.2 kilometers and a max horizontal radius of 10, which means the entire staff was caught in the explosion. You know, assuming that our assumptions about its size were correct and stuff, you know. Uh, that's great. Heyabu-no-kichi-wa-hotondo-ga-mizubi-dashite-tsukai-mono-ni-nara-nai-jo-tai-fukkyu-no-medasura-tatte-i-nai-wa. so, getting rid of the Sadagashima Hive with Japan some much-needed relief now that we're no longer uh, having an enemy base at our doorstep. Yasunu-ma-mo-naku-mo-shi-wake-nai-kedo. Oh, for fuck's sake. Uh, and what, what, what do we have? A new um, Susanoo to go with us? See, and without the Susanoo? I, I, I mean, hell. Sumiki hasn't even fully recovered yet. Hmm. We're infiltrating the hives. That means Samika managed to get in, uh, some good info from her reading. Like where they have to store the where they store the G elements or you know something. What is that? S elevens. Bombs powerful enough to take out a hive's reactor. And the coolant surface pilots preferred methods of suic uh, method of suicide. So we're finally gonna be equipped with them, huh? Oh, we didn't have them before? I assume we had them before. I assumed everyone had them before. I know they said like the Americans don't have them and the Japanese do have them, but I guess I assumed we are on the Japanese side of that. Now that I think about it, we are the UN, so that isn't a necessary uh, requirement or a given. Roger. よくぞ達成してくれた。私は諸君を誇らしく思う。だがその一方で、イスミ隊、柏木少尉を失ったことは、イスミ隊、柏木少尉両名がなした人類への貢献を鑑みれば、本来二階級特進の上、軍装を持
But um, we we're low on resources, so we can only we can only promote them one rank, right? Not even the rank increase? Oh, come on. <laughs> I mean, training accident, training some accident, whatever, just give him the two ranks, man. だが、以前その道のりは長く険しい。うん。これからも数々の難局が我々の行く手に待ち受けていることだろう。だが、神宮寺軍曹に鍛え上げられ、いつみたいの元で磨かれた諸君であれば、諸君のより相当奮戦に
And we did uh, all our damnedest out there. Humanity didn't back down for a second. Though, I guess it's hard to call it a decisive victory. We took out the hive, the Sadagashima hive, but the rest of the island with it. But isn't that amazing? It's the first time humanity's taken out a phase four hive. <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, and um, I was totally fine, too. I didn't get cold feet or have a panic attack or anything. Not bad, huh? They threw me into the middle of that huge battle, and for the first time, I actually kept my head and got the job done. <laughs> you see me? You're acting weird. You seem like you want to say something. Why is she being so quiet? Something happened while I was gone. Ooh, it's wrong. Takusan. Changed? Hmm? Takusan kotu arimashita ne. Uh, yeah, I guess you could say that. Can't really keep secrets from Kazumi, can I? Not sure why I even trying. Kanashii kotu takusan gaman shimashita ne. Yeah, I... Feel like her past not going on. Yeah, that's for sure. Sorry. For what? Kasumi. You could learn how to pilot a TSF, I mean. Oh, no, here. No, no, you've been such a big help. Come on. No, come here. I wanna. No, 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 no. You, you've been great. D don't don't get in uh, don't get into Takaro emo mode. What do you mean? Don't say that to you. Oh, you mean the like mind reading stuff? Hmm. Wayne, is she talking about alternative three? It's okay. That's not your responsibility anymore. Mm. It's fine, Kasumi. You don't need to worry about that. And if you're really worried, then try to change something. Try to do something to help. Consult other people to make sure it's not, you know, like, conflicting and ends up making things worse. But if you want to make a difference, then go out and try to make a difference. Think of how you do it and do something about it. You shouldn't have to go out there. We can handle it just fine without you. <laughs> to me, it's Amika. Just knowing that you'll be here to welcome us home is a huge source of motivation. You have no idea how reassuring it is. For me and Yuko Sensei to have someone else around who knows exactly what we're going through. So please, don't be so hard on yourself. Which is fair, too. Come on. You can tell I'm being sincere, can't you? Hi. And if you keep talking like that, you'll make Samika sad, too, you know? Sorry. No need to apologize. I just want to set the record straight. It must be hard. Having to see all the sadness in everyone else's minds. I'm really sorry. I'll, I'll try to be stronger. It's okay to be sad about sad things, Takaru. You don't need to be stronger. Really, what is happening here is she's feeling guilty about not having to deal with it herself and everyone else. In, in the same way. It's almost like... There's a little bit of parallels to how you were previously. Uh, well, except she's not ignorant, uh, ignorant of it, really. You're just, you just thought that stuff on reflection before you had to deal with it yourself. Did you visit some of y'all already? Cool, okay. Let's go see her then, uh, together then. Hi. Oh. Oh, thank goodness. She looks a lot better than she did when we uh, first returned to base. Can you um, see anything, Kasumi? Yeah, that's concerning. I see. Does that mean she doesn't dream? I wonder. Oh. What is it? Ooh, as soon as I walk in, eh? Sumika. Yeah, it's me. Sumi's here too. Sumika san, okaeri nasai. Kasumi chan, kaette kite kurete. Arigato gozaimasu. 
How are you feeling? Gotcha. Then you should get some more rest then. Man, I can't believe how much I treasure these simple conversations now. After everything I've been through, I guess I finally learned not to take little things for granted. Hmm? What's up? I thought they could just see images. Mm -hmm. Huh? Is that the case? <laughs> ah, she's talking about when the Susanoa was making its approach. <laughs> you did, huh? Which means you probably heard you know what. Her priorities are a bit weird. Now I'm sort of now I'm sort of imagining her uh, going crazy in that cockpit. Yeah, that was incredible. We really saved our butts out there. Uh, I did? I mean, I guess that's one way to interpret it, but that's pretty extreme. Huh? What are you talking about? I can never stop loving you. What is going on with her? I is she about to have another episode? Why would I do what? I... I don't even know what you're talking about. Huh? Hmm. I mean, it seems to be lining up with basically what I thought happened. What are you saying? I'm not going anywhere. Calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down. It's okay, it's okay. Just make a look at me. You can read my mind, can't you? I do love you. And I'll be with you forever. Don't you see? Of course I do. I think you're just tuckered out after all that fighting. For now, just try to get some rest, okay? So needy. <laughs> sure thing. Yeah? Okay. Uh, she's definitely not... Stable. She doesn't feel stable in the slightest. I see. I don't think she was acting strangely, um... I did think she was acting strangely calm for someone who'd just been through a massive battle. Guess she's still got a ways to go before being fully stable. And yet she's gonna have to do it all over again in two weeks' time. Hmm... Man, I really thought she was past these little episodes. I mean, it was panicking in some way, maybe not a panic attack. <laughs> Wait, did you see something? That was a different timeline. This is the Sumika route, this is the ultimate Sumika route, and it's awesome, but no. Wait, wait, what? She didn't? Uh-huh. Why would she think that? Right, all Katsumi can do is read and interpret images. She can't trace back Samika's entire train of thought. No, it's okay. You didn't do anything wrong. 
See, this is what I mean. She doesn't read thoughts as words. So when she saw those feelings of discontent in my head just now, she just jumped to confusion and apologized. Can you explain what it made a uh, what made it different from all the other times? Hmm. So there was no haze of static this time, you mean? Hmm. But if her mind's more stable now, where the heck would she get the notion that I was with another girl? I guess I'd better ask Yuko Sensei about this. I'm gonna go talk to Yuko Sensei. Could you uh, keep an eye on Samika for me? You know what? I'm sort of assuming that the recording, everything that Samika isn't like perceiving, especially during the operation. You know, so that they don't have a. Uh... I, I imagine you could probably download uh, her thoughts, like her what she perceives for other people's images, much more um, significantly than an actual human. Well. A biological human that doesn't have that sort of computer interface. Hi. Ah, uh, thank you. If anything happens, you know where to find me. Hi. Hmm. Awesome. Thanks again. Hmm. I'm uh, coming in. Yeah, I do. Though I didn't know it's one thing that I want to ask you about. It's probably going to take a while to explain. You can tell me whatever you need to first. Okay. Great. That's a little soon, don't you think? I mean, Sami hasn't even fully recovered. I mean, even a month would make a big difference. If we change it from two weeks to a month. How partial are we talking here? Like, did we even manage to get that reading? Well, from quite a distance, too. Hmm. What do you mean? Okay. Wait, so then. Huh. That is very useful information. What? That's unbelievable. Oh. So it's going to take a whole week to analyze all of it. That's got to be a metric shit ton of information. How did Samika extract, extract it so fast? You know what? That's fairly fair. So we're going to try to get another blow in before they catch uh, on that humanity's gone on the offensive, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, that makes perfect sense, but... You know, the Susanovos... Well, that's nice. Huh. Right, but is there gonna be a problem? I imagine some of the parts are probably... You know... Significant? And even, like, nowadays, two weeks is still a pretty goddamn short time to actually assemble one of those, even if you had all the parts. It's fucking huge, man. Right, I guess that makes sense, yeah. Still sucks that we had to blow the original up, though. Of course, if they relay intel from one hive to the next, we really had no other choice. Letting them get their hands on that technology, letting them get their hands on that technology, could have been the final, uh, final nail in humanity's coffin. Hmm. Will the UN still only be contributing a single fleet and landing force this time around? Oh, did we lose support? Huh? Why did something happen? What? You didn't show them the information? 
Yeah, I had a feeling that was it. As much as I hate to admit it, I did catch myself thinking we could have just minimized our casualties and we just used G bombs instead. But the reading was the real objective, wasn't it? You can't say that it was a complete bust. Can we? <laughs> what do you mean? Do they not know that aspect of Alternative 4? What do people think Alternative 4 is? Wait, does she want to look. Does she want to look like a failure? Alternative 5 Suicide Hano Zanto, Abridas Tamani Kimatur Jana. Hmm, not a bad idea. Ima Sawai de Renchu Namasani Sore, Tsuni de Todomeo Sasua. Hmm, how so? Konkai knew she's the data would scat the smart on your hive will say at the stemmy ceremony. We'll see, we'll see. You know what happened last time? Things went okay, things went bad, things went okay again, things went well, then things went bad, 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 bad. Yeah. I see. Fair enough. So she's waiting to give up the hive intel and show off zero, uh, zero, zero units' effectiveness until we, uh, we've we achieved a decisive victory that no one else can argue with. That way it'll really cut those naysayers down to size. Yeah, that's true. ええ。安ポリの承認はこう are we going to attempt to take back the Asian mainland, or what? I always forget that that was a total pipe dream. A last-ditch effort we'd only resort to if we switch alternative 5. Is it even possible to launch an attack on that scale without dropping G-bombs? Oh, that's a way to... Okay, okay, so this is how the game is going to go. We're not going to go to all the highs. We're going to go after the big one. Because if we don't... This game's gonna be taking fucking forever to, you know, <laughs> end. You want to invade the original hive? So you, beta Chikyu Kodiak no choose, Ko Ichigo Mukyo Kaimetsu Sasuno. Holy shit! Humanity's victory might finally be at hand. Hmm. I thought we were still years and years away from this. Yorokobu no hayai wa. Sakusen no junbi ga hajimatte iru to wa iye. Yeah, I know. Hmm. I wonder if we're gonna get like actual like like every army in the world will send a significant amount of their troops to this. I wonder. Right, yeah. Okay. I am clear on that, but Sensei, what's going on with Samika right now? She seemed to be in a lot of pain when I talked to her. Handle it how? As far as I can tell, there's no way she'll be ready for an, uh, another mission in two weeks. And you said so yourself that we can't afford to mess this one up, so excuse me for being a little bit concerned. Okay. God damn it. I was already feeling I was already feeling emotional after what happened to Captain Azumi and Kashiwagi. So when she said that victory might be within our grasp, I completely lost my cool. Hmm. Wait. I, how is that possible? Why would her finals be more stable? Kasumi said she improved too, but I don't get why. Hmm. So, you don't even know. Some expert you are. Sensei, 
So, we still don't know why Tsuzunoo crashed then. Hmm. I think there's an easy conclusion to come to, but Taku is too, uh, I guess, absent minded to remember what he was thinking during that time. I would appreciate that. <laughs> Fuck you too, man. ゼロゼロユニットの頭蓋内は、あらゆる観測から量子伝導能を隔離するために、ODL という液体に満たされているの。これには、冷却剤として Okay. Gotcha, so that's why she's always uh, made sure I brought to make it back every two days. She only needs to be refueled every three days, but I guess Sensei didn't want to take any risk. Can't say I blame her. Zero Zero Unit no Taina ni mo, Kantan na Joka system wa aru kedo, Akuma de Kinkyuji no Jigan Kasegi level de Shikanai. Kanzen na Joka ni wa, Senyo no Setsubi ga Hitsuyo na no yo. ODL o Ketseki ni Tatoe leva, Jinko Toseki ki no yo na mono na ne. Okay. So, what happens after 72 hours? Well, great. Huh? Hmm. I can't get upset about this. This is just the way it is, now that she's the zero zero unit. Abnormal how when accelerated. I assume you wouldn't send her in a, uh, send her in a battle if she was actually reaching the time limit. So what did you say actually? So what does it actually get used up by? Like the heat? Slowly degrades over time, faster when the quantum conductor brain is firing in all cylinders. Okay, so the obvious answer would be that it's firing on all cylinders, to the biggest extent possible. Hmm. But she's supposed to be good for 72 hours, right? So why didn't she last a uh, half a day? Hmm. So that's why uh, they wouldn't let me see her again. I guess the process must take a pretty long time. But we still don't know why it degraded so fast, I take it. Or, 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 should I mention what she said? Come on, this is obviously what she was, like, focused on during the time. This should... Uh, huh? Hmm. So it works for 72 hours. Would having an extension to your body, you know, making your the brain obviously have more calculations and run faster. Would that make it degrade faster by itself? Yeah, it did. Engine yeah, I can't even imagine how hard it must have been to get all that info while having to maintain control of all those other systems. She couldn't think of any particularly complex sports to make a metaphor a little simpler, huh? How about hockey? Woo! Hockey! Woo! Well, I guess those are uh, a luxury in this world uh, that this world can't really afford. Uh, speaking of which, hockey. Yeah. My team's doing really well lately. Yeah. I'm not gonna say which, even though it actually doesn't say anything about where I live, but you know. I might have said it before in a previous episode in a previous series at some point, I don't know. Whatever. Uh, so the more complex processing, uh, when I say my team, I mean my NHL team, the one I'm a big fan of. So the more complex processing Sumi has to do, the faster this uh, ODL de uh, degrades, and the less time she has before her body shuts down. So, 
Then we almost lost her yesterday, didn't we? But you had no idea. You you would have no idea. You obviously had no idea this was going to happen. Ah, uh, yeah. That seems like a reasonable precaution to take. Not like this is no cockpit is uh, strapped for space or anything. ODL hmm. そのそう、so, Samika went unconscious for her own safety, basically. So, you I mean, I assumed. No, I said is that it uh, wouldn't be life threatening. Ah, so you were thinking about it? I was thinking it in What is wrong with this woman? If she just explained that from the get-go, I would have freaked out back then. And how you say that makes me feel as though you did it on purpose. Are you playing a game here again, Yuko? No, there's no point in blaming her for this. She's like this in every world. It's my fault for not being able to keep up with her. So basically, the reason Samika was struggling isn't directly related to the reason she fainted. Uh, uh, when in safe mode, I mean. So you got Okay, so that's why Sensei only took a brief glance at the data when I got to the Megami. In that case, I guess it's not... Weird that she's uh, more stable than she was before. I mean, she has been improving more and more as time goes on. Uh, if you got all this data on the hive, couldn't you be able to extract the data about her, like reading my mind too? I mean, come on. Hmm. Maybe some alternative five supporters tried to sabotage us? No! <laughs> so we really have no idea what might have caused it. Ma, Kanojo no Jinka ya say singa Kanzen deva naikotuna, Okina gain no hitz deva has takido. That would definitely make her more susceptible to, you know, what caused it and what we all know caused it! Do we really have to have this? I know, I, why are we taking so long to come to this conclusion? Come on. Seems like the, now would be a good time to ask the question I had. Actually, there was something I was hoping I could ask you. She said that once she got to the island, she could tell exactly where I was. Uh, right, uh, there is. Right after she mentioned firing the particle cannon, she started saying some really weird stuff. Uh, apparently she, like, thought I'd stop loving her? Or, was, or thought I was gonna, like, leave her or something. I figured she must have been having another one of those episodes, but Kasumi said it was different from before. She said Samika was convinced that I'd fallen in love with another girl, and that terrified her. And the fact that she, uh, she could still read something from her was proof that she was not having another episode. Yeah. Yeah, I think she must have read my emotions, which assume I cleared up the misunderstanding. So, Yuko, smart girl, you can figure this out, right? This is not hard to figure out. You, you know exactly what's happening, right? Do you have an idea what might have happened? Yeah, you figured it out. Just that look on your face. Yeah, I guess you could say that. Now <laughs> she envisioned it from me, because I was remembering that shit several times. You think it could have been someone in my unit? Like, maybe I was worrying about someone else's safety. <laughs> no, uh, though I do care a lot about them as comrades in arms. You think she could have mistaken that for feeling for uh, that feeling for something else? 
シロガネがいなくなるぐらいまでの勘違いはさすがに。タカルー、Do you、Are you seriously just like purposely forgetting that very two times? It happened twice! It happened twice! How do you not remember this, man? Oh,、uh, let's see here. Is there anything else I was thinking about that might have given her that impression? あんたはその時何を考えていたのか覚えてないの Um, pretty sure I was still trying to pick my jaw up off the floor after witnessing how powerful that particle cannon was. That's one image that's gonna stick with me for the rest of my life. That much I'm sure of. So did I get? Motto Kuasko, m o i d a s t e Come on, you can do it, Tiger. Shh, 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 shh. We're, we're, we're trying to focus on stuff. Come on. You're all so distracting. Shut up. It only took one shot, it took out the entire monument in a single blast. Not only that, it eradicated almost all the bait on the surface, too. XP のナジューはオルタネイティブ計画内部でウェポンシステム1101と呼ばれていてね。あくまでゼルゼルユニットの機能拡張コード。You can't, you can't see it right now, but I'm face palming. A flashback within a flashback, yep.、Yeah. 私たちが XP のナジューを接収した。No, he already had this flashback. Ah, Bones must be joking, yep, yep, and then Samika. King Tim 2, yep, yep, no. This happened like. Oh, you're okay. That's right, I was thinking about、uh, back in what you said about the XG70's weapon capabilities, hoping s a m i k a would be alright. I don't really remember exactly when that whole、uh, thing about Maya came back up again, but it definitely happened pretty fucking near it. My goodness. Yeah. Oh god, don't take this the wrong way, Yuko. No, never. Not in a goddamn million years. Fine by me. Like I said already. I was just thinking about how you called the Susanoo's attacks an added bonus. Whatever. <laughs> so I guess we're just out of the leads then. XT70 is a new one. Yep, there we go. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> yep. It's like exactly at that point, too. <laughs> oh, motherfucking great. Took you enough time. Yeah, I think I do, actually. Samika must have picked up an image that flashed into my brain. That other girl she was talking about was Maya. Sensei, I think I know what happened. So, you remember how I told you my memories from previous timelines are few and far between, right? Uh, jeez. I have no idea how to even broach this. Like, if I don't frame it carefully, she's just gonna think I'm having weird sexual fantasies in the middle of battle. Uh, so, like, for whatever reason, I sometimes get these random images flashing into my head. I don't know if they're related memories or daydreams or, or what causes them, but yeah. So, did it? Well, for one, they feel completely different to the、uh, memories that came flying back to me when I see,、uh, saw s o m e k i back in my world during our transfer experiments. <laughs> so, like, I don't know if this was actually a memory or just a daydream or what. So, I don't know. Uh, okay, well, um. It was an image of me and. I, I, I mean, Lieutenant Mitsurugi, and. Uh. 
Just to be clear, I have no recollection of this ever happening, but... Well... Uh, kinda, yeah. Uh, b basically, uh, Mr. Rugi and I were uh, given my ass in this world. I gotta be like I should be arrested for the thought, cr for, for thought crimes right about now. Yes. Basically, yeah. Um, it just popped into my head out of nowhere. It was unbelievably vivid. Fuck. What did I think? Why do you think I was so hesitant to admit it? Anyway, seeing that big cloud of smoke reminded me of when Mount Tengen erupted in the previous timeline. Ah. Uh, yeah, that's it. Once we got, uh, once we cut down that rock, I remember getting trapped with May in the cockpit. I don't really remember anything after that. Hmm. Uh, I wouldn't say I'm being wistful here, but okay. Mae the best part about this is that I actually did do May as a route in Unlimited. <laughs> so this is a legitimate thing. It's not just like I'm remembering something that I never actually had a part in. Uh, uh, because I didn't do the route. So. <laughs> Though I suppose that, that could have, that could have, that probably would have happened regardless. But it, it's more significant because there actually was, at least in my adventure through all this, a talker that did actually, multiple ones if you include extra, that did actually get it on with me. God, I'm just saying that. <laughs> For fuck's sake, today. Oh, what is today? Right. Was that really a memory from the previous timeline, though? Or was I just having a dirty daydream like any other teenager? But, like, do you really think it would have affected her that badly? Huh? In a sense, yeah. Basically, every single one of them have been that. <laughs> that is none of your business. That's the thing you're gonna focus on? Okay. I mean, sure, I'll give you that, but that's only in the most extreme of cases. Wait, shit, you're not suggesting that Samiko was trying to kill me. Oh, shit, if she becomes like Yandere in this, that would be interesting. That would be very interesting, at the very least. I'm not sure what I think of it. You know what? <laughs> I'm now remembering the discussion about how a rogue Samika would be one of the most dangerous things ever. Now, if she went yandere on me... Holy motherfucking shit! What would I do? I would be so fucked! I sort of want to see that happen now, just because of how interesting that concept is. Yeah... Yeah, she does feel pretty strongly about that hatred of the beta, eh? So then, you think my thoughts are what caused the Susan Noah to... So it's my fault. I got you while getting Captain Sumi are dead. Hmm? What happened happened? Could have I really stopped what happened? Would I have been able to change anything? I mean, it's a random thought that popped into your head and Samika overreacted. Ultimately, you can say it's cause and effect as much as you want. You could say it's Maya's fault because she's the one who did shit in another timeline. But she's the one who reciprocated that and really wanted to stick around at Mount Tengen. You could say it's... 
I, there are so many. If you're just going to go down the line and choose the time when you were in the cause and effect to say, it's my fault, it's my fault, it's my fault, then you're just going out of your way to make it your fault at that point. Now, but I mean, you can feel bad about it, but realize that you're doing that. I'm not crying. God, I will, but still. Sibarashi Kotajanai. Antawa, Tanki can the Tondemonai Seka wagetano. Hm? Huh? Somebody, Zero Zero Unit, I suppose that's one way of looking at it. Antawa Tata Tokatarazi, Zero Zero Unit, Sokoma de Toritz Stanjanai. You know, the more you give me credit for this, the more it is looking more like it's my fault. <laughs> what now? Wait, 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 what's that last part? Sensei seems pretty elated right now, but according to Kasumi, she's suffering on the inside too. Such as a misery. Yeah, she's trying to put on a blah blah face to blah blah emotionally manipulate other people into good st yeah 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 just like everyone else in this world that is so desperate to achieve their goal that they are not willing to actually show their feelings. <laughs> Whatever. I wonder if she blames me. I wouldn't be surprised if this one blames me to at least a little bit about both, uh... Uh... She... What was her name? Sergeant Jinguji. They haven't said her name in such a long time that I'm starting to forget Marimo. Marimo, that was her name. And now another good friend of her, Captain Asumi, some that makes sense. Also, someone in you know, a way that you could blame it on me. I wonder if she does that to at least some small extent. I wonder if she blames herself, too, and is looking at things positively. Hmm. But if I hadn't let that one stupid thought into my mind, then Operation 21st would have been a total success. Kashibaki and the captain would have had to die. <laughs> it, you can't control that, Dr. Rue. Hell no. I'm not going to celebrate. They just died yesterday. I'm not the kind of person who can just switch my emotions on and off like that. So See, my general thoughts on this sort of thing is similar to, say, like, in a sports game. Let's go back to hockey, because hockey's awesome. Um, and, he, he, like, if someone makes, like, a play slightly differently, like, oh, you had a defensive lapse and they scored in, like, the first period of the three periods, it's like... Oh, and then you lose by one. It's like, oh, if we didn't have that defensive lap, we would have had a tie game, could have gone overtime, etc. Let's be realistic here. If that goal hadn't gone in, the entire game would have been different. You have no idea what would have happened. It's a bit butterfly effect uh, style reasoning, but realistically, when you're dealing with a bunch of people making decisions based on stuff, a massive status change changes what happens immensely. Think about it. Because if you're in a mindset where you're thinking, oh, I'm down by one. Oh, we gotta go score, gotta go do that. Or we're tied. It's completely different to how you can react. You may have some similarities. You may do some of the same things. You may not change your decision making too extensively because it sort of depends on the situation. But in the end, a change of frame of mind like that is going to change little things enough constantly that things are gonna go immensely different. Especially when you have thousands like, especially in the beta battle, thousands of people whose frame of mind would change immensely and all making their own little decisions, little things, building up, completely different stuff, and the status would be, etc, etc, etc. It's hard to imagine. She has a good point, as in I completely agree with her on that concept, because I know what she's getting at. How am I supposed to know? I have changed. I'm not running away from my guilt anymore. I'm not the 
I'm the one who killed Marima Chan and hurt Samika in the other world. And I'm responsible for the deaths of Sergeant Chin Chi and the countless other surface pilots in this one. And whether she was just a brain or not, I'm still directly involved in the murder of this world, Samika. <laughs> I'm not going to pretend I didn't have a hand in all that. Which is fair, too. But you also need to realize that things being immensely different. One little action isn't the thing that causes stuff. It's... You need to acknowledge your involvement in a chain of events that leads to certain things. But you don't need to take complete responsibility for all that. You don't need to say, it's my fault. It is my fault and it's my complete responsibility to make up for it. I mean, you can try to take some responsibility, but there's a middle ground between the two things here that really needs to be taken. <laughs> you know, for a healthy mind, healthy body, healthy future. But I'm not like you, Sensei. I can just move past a tragedy that only happened yesterday. <laughs> You're the one who told me I shouldn't throw away my emotions. Can't I have even one day to mourn the loss of my comrades? <laughs> my team perfectly normal in front of everyone else. Indeed. I made sure anything's possible. あんたは気点に無限に分岐するはずの確率時空が閉じてしまっているのよ。あんたはこの世界で死んだらまた時間遡って10月からやり直しなのよ。I know. I know. I'm not hoping for another reset, believe me. I have to settle this now. Before this world's causality completely overrides the other timeline and kills everyone. But I suppose she does have a point, come to think of it. Even if I handled all these events perfectly by utilizing my memories from this time, Probably just accelerate certain things in unpredictable ways with consequences I can't even imagine. There's no way to know whether I could adapt to these outcomes. I might wind up getting even more people killed in the process. And it's not like I retained any memories of people dying from the last loop. Well, I don't even remember my own death. So I obviously cannot uh, expect to uh, prevent these sorts of events. That's not. It's not just that either. If I'd somehow known all those people were going to die in the XM3 trials, would I still have been able to uh, tell Sensei about the beta surfacing Nigata? Would I, have, would I have been able to stand back and let people die for the good of Alternative 4? That's right. As long as I'm supporting Alternative 4, there's one crime I can never avoid. No matter how many times I loop back around uh, to let Samika die, so she can become the Zero Zero unit. <laughs> Yeah, I'm pretty sure I remember. What the hell is that based on, anyways? It's just like a random rating people get? Is there a cause and effect to what uh, creates that rating, that level? それは天皇世界から漏れ出す方を第二の西洋領域で受け取り無意識のうちに的確な行動を選択して正解である世界を選び取る能力です。いや、言ってる。今私たちが生きている時間はゼロゼロユニットの素体候補者だったイスミが選
人様なら許されるちょっとしたあの嫌ささやかな自分への褒美なんて贅沢私にもあんたにも許されない Sorry, you're right. I was being stupid. I'm going to finish this this time around. No matter what. Not that. Not that that wasn't the plan all along, of course. I'm going to break out of this endless space time loop now, before it ever happens again. And on that note, once this war is over, I mean, I have a favor to ask of you. I want your assistance. If I ever want to find out what made me a causality conductor to begin with, I'm gonna need your help. <laughs> Once I find and eliminate that, I'll be able to save all the worlds I've effectively doomed. I don't care if I ever go back to my own world. As long as I can fix it, that's good enough for me. <laughs> What other choice do I have? Just because I don't completely trust you doesn't mean that's. There's a choice. Hmm. Well, that sounds suspicious. That doesn't matter to me. I've made up my mind. Please. Help me get rid of whatever it is that made me a causality conductor. Sensei. Hmm. Thank you so much. Hmm. Well, I still appreciate it. Just to make it Blah, 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 blah. Well, I wouldn't go that far. You saw the way I started whining just now. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. またしても、お互いの利害が一致したところで、現状の対処に戻りましょう。オッケー。まず、異常劣化の原因は、彼女の嫉妬と見てほぼ間違いないはずよ。うーん、オッケー。まあ、because her just saying, like, I, I agree to do it, but I'm probably never going to tell you everything that this actually, uh, that actually went on here. Makes me feel as though she definitely knows much more than she lets on about all the causes and whatnot. Yeah. She always feels like she's playing a long game, even if she's taking events and moving it to her manipulation. Hmm. Or taking events that she doesn't know about and manipulating them to her uh, what she wants them to achieve for her even if she's doing that she always feels like she's trying to play a long game so i never take any of her words all that sincerely i do think that there's some sincerity there but in the end it feels like most a lot of the things she said can be have ulterior motives basically even if she is sincere in what she says well I think I'm going to leave it there, so see you all next time. Drive safely, everyone.